Hi, I'm John Holden. Welcome to Earth. Our next stop, the desert of Arizona. At last count, more than a billion cars are currently traveling our world's roads, more than 280 million in the US alone. But as we all know, eventually every car and truck breaks down and becomes a useless piece of metal. So where will your car or truck go to die when it reaches the end of life? Can any of it be saved? Earth traveled to Casa Grande, Arizona to find out. The auto recycling industry reclaims more than 750 million pounds of scrap each month from wrecked or abandoned vehicles. In fact, cars are the most recycled consumer product on the planet. More than 10 million are recycled in the U.S. and Canada every year. About 95% of car materials can be repurposed, especially metals like steel, copper, and aluminum. This type of recycling replaces the need to dig for raw materials. Every ton of reused steel conserves 2,500 pounds of iron ore, 1,400 pounds of coal, and 120 pounds of limestone. That results in reduced global warming and pollution. The importance of scrap metal as this, such as it's already been refined in a sense of it's already been ored out of the planet. All those resources have already been allocated into pulling that material out. Now you're pulling it back out of society, we're able to process it and reuse it without having to go back into the earth to grab more material. These days, lots of companies are doing their part to help lower greenhouse gas emissions by recycling end of life. For example, that's why when someone totals a car in an accident, the insurance company will likely make sure it's disposed of properly. Even a totaled car usually still contains parts that can be sold in the vehicle repair market. But whose job is it to take discarded cars apart and distribute all the useful stuff? Well, the world's largest auto recycler is LKQ Corporation, a global company which processes over 800,000 cars a year at one of its 170 facilities. Facilities like this one in Casa Grande, Arizona. The mission of LKQ is very simple. We want to be the leading global distributor of vehicle parts and accessories. Now, the story started in 1998, and we had a vision to consolidate the auto salvage industry, which at the time was a very large but highly fragmented cottage industry filled with mom and pop operators. After acquiring the businesses, what we brought to the table was financial and human capital, core business processes in a control framework that allowed us to create highly efficient, sustainable operations. So here's how the operation works here in Casa Grande. An end-of-life car is purchased by LKQ, after which they identify all parts on each vehicle to determine whether they will use them for resale or for scrap. The car is then brought into dismantling. All fluids are removed and the car is tagged as to what parts stay on the car or what gets pulled. The fender, the door mirror, both front and rear doors are still salvageable. Um, this nice packet of tags we have here is what we identify what we're going to re, uh, reuse um, through our inventory process. Wow, pretty thick. It's a lot of parts. It, uh, on average, we're we, we inventory about 130 to 140 parts um, on any given car. The primary focus of our recycling operations is really on the recovery of parts that can be used to repair other vehicles. It may be mechanical parts like engines and transmissions, or it can be body parts like hoods, fenders, doors. Here we have a quarter panel uh, for a car. 
There's millions of cars that have end of life that come off the road every year. LKQ processes over 800,000 of those each year. Take this one car for example, it'll never see the road again, but LKQ wants to ensure that every part on it has a second chance of life. Environmental sustainability is the foundation that LKQ is built upon. Because of our commitment to recycling 90% or more of end of life vehicles, millions of gallons of caustic or hazardous materials are saved from contaminating our lands and our groundwater. They recycle everything. They reuse their oil, they reuse their gasoline. Uh, there isn't a drop of liquid in those vehicles when they left. The yard's pristine. It's just, it's a, it's a great operation. And so we're, we're super happy to have them here. Uh, glad that, you know, we're one of 1,500 locations uh, and glad that they picked Casa Grande. The future of automobile recycling is incredibly bright. You have to remember, there are hundreds of millions of vehicles on the road each and every day. And that number is only going up with each passing year. The key is every one of those vehicles will ultimately come to the end of their useful life. And that's when LKQ can step in and make our magic happen. I like to say that LKQ is improving the world one part at a time. And now you know what can happen when you finally say goodbye to your favorite old car. It's going to a better place. Or at least parts of it are. I'm John Holden. Thanks for watching.